Guys, the new Fancy Nation merch is here. There are so many cool outfits. You can even buy the suit I wear in my videos. Guys, be sure to join the group in the description. What's up, guys? Guys, we just hit 50,000 subscribers, and in this video, we will answer 50 questions from you guys. So there's a bunch of questions in this video, so be sure to watch till the end. Anyway, so let's get started. Alright guys, so the channel just hit 50,000 subscribers, which is absolutely crazy, so thank you very much for all the support. But anyways, in this video we're actually answering 50 questions from you guys, so we're going to be quick about this and start to answer them right away. So let's get started with the first question from Jelly Jellies, and this person actually has three questions. And the first one is, what is your real name? And guys, my real name is actually Elliot, and it's spelled E-L-L-I-O-T, so not two T's, two O's, two E's, it's only two L's. And Jelly's second question is, what Roblox game? do you play? No guys, besides Piggy and Bacon, I actually play games like Tower Heroes, and that's basically a tower defense game, and I really like that game. But another horror game I also play is Survive the Killer, and then I usually play other random games as well. And the last question Jelly has is, when will you add another pet to the roster? Clucker the Chicken. <laughs> okay, I'm pretty sure this person is talking about Bubba the Bear and Oinky the Piglet, but basically a third pet. And at the moment, I actually don't know what pet that would be, but I will definitely add a third pet in the future. If you if you guys have any ideas for pets, be sure to comment them down below. Anyways, moving on to the next question from Gavin Brissac. Are you secretly friends with John Cena? <laughs> Because that is the only answer to how you have 50k subs. No, sorry. <laughs> Puffy Pup asks, is Guesty coming out today? And if yes, will you play it? Now he wrote this comment a day ago, so clearly Guesty hasn't released yet. But guys, the developers say that Guesty will be out within two weeks. So keep an eye out for that. And yes, I will definitely be playing Guesty when that comes out. Indian Army asks, when did you start gaming? Now I've actually played games ever since I was little. So I've been playing all the time, actually. Have you ever played Minecraft? Yes, I actually played Minecraft before Roblox. The first clip on my channel is actually a Minecraft clip, but I put it on private so you can't see it right now. Hey everyone, it's your boy Fancy back with another Skywars video where we are attempting the ice bucket water kill a person with TNT MLG challenge. Sounds great. <laughs> Anyways, this challenge was suggested by me because I have no subscribers. But maybe I'll let members see it in the future, I'm not really sure. Anyways, Indian Army's third question is, do you like India? <laughs> I, I don't have any issues with India, so yeah, I, I, I guess I like India. <laughs> Which is your most favorite game in Roblox? Now once again, I would probably say Tower Heroes, because it's basically a game where I can kind of be AFK and work on a video at the same time. But if I had to pick one of the horror games, then I would probably say Survive the Killer, but guys, I'm pretty sure that Guesty will be one of my new favorite games. Alright, here we have the fifth question from Giga God Plays. And he's asking, why do you think Mandy Mouse is crawling in the vents without her wheelchair whatsoever? I would probably say it's because this potion makes the person more powerful. So basically Mandy Mouse doesn't need her wheelchair to move around. She can basically pull herself forward using her arms. Storus Gaming asks, when are you doing a face reveal? Now guys, I've seen this question so many times, like literally in all my comment sections. Okay, let's actually start with if I'm doing a face reveal. And yes, I'm most likely doing a face reveal in the future, but when, I'm not really sure. A lot of people want me to do a face reveal when I hit 50k, 100k, or maybe a million. And yes, that could happen, but guys, I would say the day I'm ready for it, I would literally just go ahead and do it at once. It's kind of like Flamingo, he just did it all of a sudden. It wasn't at a certain goal, but once again, I'm not really sure when this will happen. And the next question is actually the same one, but the second question is, what made you inspired for making YouTube channel and play Roblox? Hope you will answer my questions. Now, the main inspiration to make a YouTube channel is because I really like to create content for people. Like, I've always made games for people to enjoy and I also made these short videos for my friends to watch so that was my inspiration for making a YouTube channel now what inspired me to play Roblox okay so if this is out of a YouTube perspective I play Roblox because Roblox has a lot of different games and there's basically an endless amount of games out there so as a youtuber I will always have video ideas in Roblox but if we're talking about why I started playing Roblox in the first place it was basically because I was kind of bored of Minecraft and I've always heard of Roblox but I've never given it a try so basically I tried it out and I actually still remember the first time I played. I was basically a bacon hair in Murder Mystery. And then when the round started, I literally became the murderer the very first time I played. I remember chasing this person with a radio blasting the gummy bear song. And it was a really weird first experience for Roblox.
Roblox. But you know, I stuck around and I really enjoyed it. I would probably say that prison life is the main reason I liked Roblox so much. Alright, Catcraft Mika asks, are you planning on doing a face reveal? What's your favorite color? It is green. To be more specific, lime green. What's your favorite animal? This is actually a good question. I can't actually decide. I actually like three very different animals. I like dogs, I like monkeys, and I like penguins. And as you can tell, it's pretty hard to decide from those three animals. The next question is, do you have any pets? No, I don't have any pets. I used to have a goldfish when I was really young, but that's the only pet I've ever had. What made you get into making YouTube videos? Now, I've already talked about this, but another reason why is probably because I watched a lot of other YouTubers, and I felt like I could actually make decent content on YouTube if I started making videos. So that's kind of what happened. But the thing is, my channel didn't blow up until a year later, because basically, before I only uploaded like one video a month, and it wasn't until February when I started uploading every single day, where my channel literally blew up. And a question from me, no, not me, but this person called me. Do you plan on making another piggy video dressed up as piggy and scaring the folks that think you are a piggy? I actually really enjoyed making that video. It's kind of unfortunate how the microphone got messed up in that video, but yeah, I will definitely do more disguise trolls in the future, if you guys want to see it, of course. And the last question is, who's better, Oinky or Bobo? Now guys, obviously I like both, but if I have to mention something good about both of them, the good thing about Bobo is that he's been with me from the very start. So if you watch my first video, you will actually see him talk with me in the video. And what's good about Oinky is he's kind of like a token of gratitude for the Piggy game, because basically Piggy made my channel really popular, and I feel like having a pig on my head kind of reminds me of what Piggy did for my channel. But yeah, I like both, but according to my fans, majority actually prefer Bobo over Oinky. Alright, the 10th question, when will you do a face reveal, when will you do a hand reveal? Okay, I already answered the face one, but a hand reveal? <laughs> I don't even know what to say to that question, to be honest. <laughs> Alright, the next one is from Galaxy Wolf. What is your real name and how old are you? Alright, so once again, my name is Elliot and my age is 19. I will soon be 20. What's your favorite thing about Piggy and Bacon? Alright, so my favorite thing about Piggy is the story and my favorite thing about Bacon is the challenge. V Renee asks, my question, when are you going to do a Piggy Chapter 11 prediction video? I will gladly appreciate it. And guys, this video is actually out, so be sure to watch that video. Anyways, on to the next question from Jonathan Aaron. Away. I really don't know how to pronounce that, but anyways, how old are you? Why do you think they use Robbie and Mole? Um, I would say the reason they use Robbie and Mole. Actually, I don't know, that's a good question. But like, I guess if there's a toy store in the mall, and there's this big robot that came to life, that's how Robbie starts chasing you, I guess? Do you think that Mousy will be a skin in the piggy shop? Um, I'm not really sure. I guess it would happen if Mousy could stand up, but once again, Mousy can't stand up, so I don't really think it will happen. Joynito asks, when did you realize a lot of people started to like your videos and you liked making your videos. So I've always liked making videos and to be honest I've always had good feedback on my videos because in my very first video Rainway actually commented on the video giving me very good feedback. But the moment a lot of people started liking my videos was the moment I blew up and that was when I recorded Piggy Chapter 3 I believe. Ria Nijo asks when did you start your YouTube channel? So I created my YouTube channel in 2015 so it's pretty old but I never uploaded until I believe 2016 when I uploaded like one Minecraft video, but in my opinion the official beginning is last year the 26th of April when I uploaded my very first Roblox video spending 20,000 Robux to escape prison in Mad City. So I would say last year in April. Toma Era asks, are you gonna make a predictions of chapter 11? And I'm pretty sure I already answered this, but once again the video is already out so be sure to check it out. Nacho Miranda asks, what games do you play that are not Piggy and Bacon? Which game is your favorite that is not on Roblox? And at the moment I would actually say that's Valorant. And Valorant Valorant is kind of like Arsenal, but it's more like you only have one life per round, so you have to be really tactical with your decisions. And the last question is, how is your day? My day is great, thank you for asking. <laughs> how is your day? Huffypup asks, do you think this helicopter signal that Pony found is a trap? Because there was a note that says, don't trust this signal. So it wasn't fully finished, but I think it's don't trust the signal and we are entering a trap. Please notice this fancy smash. <laughs> so I'm pretty sure it's don't trust the signal, but guys, if Minitune is very smart about this, then this would actually mean like, don't trust the sisters, and then C and Susie would actually be bad people. But like, once again, I'm pretty sure it's the signal, not the sisters. Rosemary Lee Nag says, Fancy, you're the only tester in Guesty. When will you upload a Guesty video? And guys, I'm actually uploading another Guesty video very soon, because the developers actually had more stuff to show you, so stay tuned for that. And here we have a bunch of questions from TKRM Bam Bam, and we're actually jumping straight to the second question, who inspired you to start my YouTube channel? And I didn't really have any inspirations, to be honest, but I guess I guess I liked the pals when they were a thing. Since when did you start playing Roblox? And guys, I actually started playing Roblox the 30th of December 
2016. So basically the last day of 2016. Specs Corner asks, why are you so entertaining? And I'm not really sure if I'm that entertaining, but I'm happy you think so. So thank you very much. Just Play Legit writes, what would you say is a better game, Piggy or Bacon? Piggy is clearly the better game because of the story. But once again, I feel like Piggy has to add a lot more content in the shop because Bacon has so much content. All it is, he says, who's your favorite Piggy character and why? I would actually say George Piggy is my favorite, simply for the fact that he's been on his own for this whole time. Anyways, the third question is, if you were a mini tune, what map would you put for chapter 11? Now guys, I would actually like to see a map high up in the air, like a plane map, and I think that could happen if we chase down this helicopter, or maybe it's Mr. P that will pick us up and then take us to like an airbase. Anyways, what is your subscriber goal? Now for this year, it's actually 100,000 subscribers, because for me it would be crazy to go from 1,000 subscribers to 100,000 in one year. So yeah, that's the goal, 100,000 subscribers. How many chapters do you think Piggy will have? And also, congrats to 50k, thank you dude, I appreciate it. It's already confirmed that Piggy will have 12 chapters, so basically it will be 12 chapters. And here, oh my god, we have so many questions from Edwin Barrera, who is a member of this channel. Alright, let's see here, what is your name? Already answered that. What made you start YouTube? Already answered that. When are you going to finish the games you are working on? I would say expect my games to be finished around June, so keep an eye out for those. When are you showing your face? How old are you? Are you going to play the bacon update? I'm probably going to play the next bacon chapter update, so stay tuned for that. When is your birthday? My birthday is the 24th of August. And to be more specific, I was born the year of 2000, which is pretty dope. What country do you live in? I live in Sweden. Is Oinky the Piglet going to start talking? I'm pretty sure Oinky the Piglet prefers to oink instead of talk. What is your favorite game? Do you have any pets? What is your favorite YouTuber? Now my favorite Roblox YouTuber would probably be Dennis. I really like how calm he is in his videos. What is your favorite food? I would probably say Indian food. What is your favorite color? What is your favorite thing to do? My favorite thing to do is to create stuff for people to enjoy, such as games, videos, and other stuff. But obviously, I also like playing games. Do you know when Guesty is coming out? Once again, guys, I expect Guesty to be released within two weeks. Are you going to be making bacon prediction videos? Now, the thing is, I would do this if the bacon story actually made sense, because at the moment, I don't really understand the story still, and there isn't much to predict at the moment. Galaxy Wolf asks, which map is the hardest, hospital, city, or the mall? Now for me, hands down the city, because the city took me like two hours to record, and usually I only have to record like 40 minutes. So yeah, the city map is definitely the hardest map. In Piggy Chapter 10, what do you think don't trust the S means? I think it means don't trust the signal. But if Minitune wants to be clever, he should probably write something else, like don't trust the sisters, like a big plot twist. Do you watch any anime? If so, which ones? I do not watch anime. I mean, I guess when I was a kid, I watched Pokemon, but that's about it. I Evil Creeper asks, when are you gonna update Alien Facility Tycoon? Now guys, if you don't know what Alien Facility Tycoon is, it's actually my own game in Roblox, so be sure to check it out. But anyways, at the moment, I'm focusing on my new games, but after those games have been completed, maybe I will update Alien Facility Tycoon. Why do you play Roblox a lot, a lot? I don't really play it a lot, a lot, but I really enjoy it. I guess it's because there are so many different games on the platform. Will you do a face reveal when you answer our questions? Once again, I will do a face reveal in the future, so not in this video. <laughs> Can you show a tour of your home, please? Now, I would probably start by showing off my face before I show off my house. <laughs> WolfoxGamer20 asks, when was the first time you ever played Piggy on Roblox? Now, the first time I played Piggy on Roblox was like a week after the game had released. So basically, there was only one chapter, and I remember playing the game with my friends, and my friends thought the game was really bad, and they basically left the game immediately, but I stuck around to play the game a bit more, and I really liked the game, but the thing is, I didn't to record it because I thought I was too late because once again the game had been out for one week already and then I saw chapter 2 come out and that's when I made my very first piggy video I believe it was called this scary piggy will give you nightmares so be sure to check it out Kevin Gomez writes you should be hitting 5 million you make amazing content you completely deserve it this isn't a question by the way <laughs> thank you very much dude I really appreciate it silent wither tm another channel member asks where do you live I live in Sweden will you ever play simulators no guys right before my channel blew up, I actually played a simulator called Viking Simulator. So be sure to watch that and tell me what you think of me playing simulators. What is the inspiration behind the name Fancy Smash? Okay, so this is kind of weird. I have no inspiration for this name. Like, literally, guys, I made up this name when I was, like, 11 or 13 or something. And basically, I remember the moment I made up the name. It was basically when I got my Nintendo 3DS and my parents told me not to use my real name. And then, literally, I got this, like, instant reaction to call myself Fancy Smash. And, guys, I know it sounds completely fake and weird, but literally that is everything
thing I remember. Will you ever live stream Piggy or something? I've actually live streamed before, so I will definitely do it again. So stay tuned for that. Hamza Asif asks, when did you start YouTube? What is your first Roblox video? Okay, so in my opinion, my first video is the spending 20,000 Roblox to escape prison. But I actually uploaded one video before that, which was the game trailer for my Roblox game Alien Facility Tycoon. Are you gonna make a Piggy Chapter 11 mystery video? Once again, it is already out. Awesome Aaron asks, who, what inspired you to play Piggy? It was actually myself, but I guess it was Survive the Killer. Because basically, before Piggy, I played Survive the Killer. And Survive the Killer really helped out my channel. So I guess Survive the Killer inspired me to play other horror games like Piggy. Can you make more Murder Mystery 2 videos? Yes, I will definitely make a Murder Mystery 2 video when Season 2 comes out. And here we have another question asking, why do you sound younger in your older videos? I mean, the thing is, when I listen to myself in my older videos, I sound a lot more serious and in my opinion I sound older but once again in my older videos I was younger so I guess that's why I sound younger. <laughs> why do you only make Roblox videos? The reason I make Roblox videos is because Roblox has so many different games so it's not simply one type of game in Roblox. What inspired you to make YouTube videos? Are you safe from the virus? Yes I am hopefully. Elvana Shini asks do you have a girlfriend? Now I can make a simple yes or no answer out of this but I'm going to let you guys figure this one out. <laughs> Which is your least favorite piggy skin and trap. Okay, so trap wise, it is definitely the mini trap. It is so worthless in my opinion. And my least favorite piggy skin, I would probably say mother pig. But like the thing is, I really hate Tigri simply for the fact that Tigri players are always so good. <laughs> Do you have a discord server? No, I don't. I don't have one for my YouTube channel yet, but I will definitely make one in the future. So stay tuned for that. With the kitty asks, hey fancy, I know I'm kind of late, but what are you gonna do when piggy is finished? And have you ever thought about making a Roblox game yourself? Okay, so I'm actually working on big projects for my channel but for the time being I will probably play other piggy games like Guesty. and guys let me just tell you these upcoming weeks will be crazy for piggy games because there will be a bunch of new piggy games being released now I can't really tell you more than that but stay tuned for more because a lot more is coming all right and once again I already made a Roblox game called Alien Facility Tycoon will you stop playing games like piggy and go back to random games no I will not I actually really like horror games I actually played bear way back in the days so I'm not planning to stop playing piggy games. I really like them. All right, here we have an interesting one. Rank all the piggy maps from chapter one to chapter 10. Okay, so let's see here. We have the house, station, gallery, forest, school, hospital, metro, carnival, city, and the mall. So guys, let's actually start with the worst map to the best. All right, guys, I would say the worst map is actually the station map. I guess one of the reasons being the map is really easy. And then guys, I would go for the school map because it's not really that special. I mean, sure, you meet bunny, but that's about it. And then I would go for the metro map and then the hospital map. Okay, now it's getting pretty hard. I guess the gallery map is the next one. Okay, I guess I gotta eliminate the house map now. Because once again, it's a classic, but there's nothing too special about it. And then I would actually say the mall map is the third best map in the game. And guys, the forest map and the city map. Both of these maps are very different. Alright guys, I'm actually going to say the second best map in Piggy is the city map. And the best one is the forest map. Because the thing is, I really like the atmosphere of the forest map. And it's not super hard, but it's still a pretty challenging map. But yeah, once again, the forest map and the city map are basically equal. Ellison Cruz asks, how many videos do you do daily? Love your videos, Fancy. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Now, the thing is, I try to upload one video a day, but that usually doesn't happen. It's usually like one video every second day. And sometimes I upload like three videos in one day like a crazy person. <laughs> so yeah, it's pretty random at the moment, but I'm going to try to upload one video every day. Kogolina asks, will you make Bobo speak again? Now, he actually actually talks in my videos now. Hello. He doesn't talk as much as he used to, but he still talks here and there in the videos. But I will definitely try to make Bobo more involved in the videos. Be sure to let me know if you want that to happen. All right, guys, the final three questions. All right, Doc asks, how did you find Piggy? I found it on the popular page of Roblox. What were you doing before YouTube? Before YouTube, I was actually studying and playing games and making Roblox games. How old are you? I'm 19 once again. Are you doing a face reveal? And when? How did you find Roblox? Thanks, Fancy. Love your videos. Thank you very much, dude. I appreciate the support. All right, two more questions, guys. Love Uni YT Games asks, what led you to this big career? Did Piggy become your video inspiration? Okay, so basically, the first 10 months of my channel, I only uploaded like 15 videos. So I barely uploaded anything on YouTube. But once I started uploading Survive the Killer every single day, within like a week, I got a bunch of more subscribers. But it wasn't until I made Piggy videos when my channel really blew up. All right, here we go, guys. The last question, and this is actually a great question to finish off the video. Boulder123E asks, what is your subscriber goal for this year? My subscriber
subscriber goal is 100,000 subscribers because once again going from a thousand subscribers to a hundred thousand subscribers in one year that would be insane so yeah that is the goal a hundred thousand subscribers let's make it happen guys but anyways guys those were the 50 questions for my 50,000 subscriber special I hope you enjoyed this video and hopefully it doesn't take forever to edit because I feel like this video could be super long anyways once again a special thanks to all my members if you're interested in becoming a member be sure to click the join button on the front page of my channel anyways guys thanks for all the support and thank you for watching this video i will see you in the next one peace